Hello, and welcome back to Astral Codex's channel. This is the first in a new series of videos, where I highlight new items from recently released quests that are worth farming. In this video, I'll explain why you should farm the Maeve's Tears build from the newly reimagined Melissa quest in Solanesca. At first glance, the stats on the belt are unimpressive. It's 8 block parry dodge, 9 crit, 9 bonus, whiz, and and luck are nothing extraordinary, and it lacks the main stat and avoidance of similar belts. Most importantly, the belt's minus 9 all resist makes it seem downright bad, as this means that equipping the belt will increase all damage you take by 9%. However, the key thing to realize is that in Dragon Fable, all resist includes health resist. Having more all resist will decrease the amount that you heal. As a result, equipping a belt that decreases your all resist by 9 will increase the amount you heal by 9%. For comparison, the previous best healing belt was Augurex Treasure, which has net minus 5 health resist. Maeve's Tears, on the other hand, has net minus 9 health resist making it significantly better for minus health gear swap. The max level belt is also relatively easy to farm, as the quest involves only a single, relatively easy boss fight versus Melissa, which you can complete in about 3 turns with Chaos Weaver. So, I think it's definitely worth your time to farm the new quest for the Maeve's Tears belt. As always, thanks for watching, and good luck!